Lord Sugar has taken to Twitter to land a jibe at former Arsenal footballer Tony Adams' odds of winning Strictly Come Dancing. The business mogul, 75, reignited his feud with former Good Morning Britain host Piers Morgan over the chances of his beloved Arsenal winning the Premier League, but Piers was quick to hit back and defend the sportsman. In view of his 5.2 million followers, The Apprentice star took aim at the former sportsman. Lord Sugar wrote, Terrible bad luck Arsenal second goal and Spurs red card. Anyway at Piers Morgan Arsenal have as much chance of winning the PL as at Tony A. Dams winning strictly. However, Piers quickly hit back at the businessman warning him against mocking the sportsman. The talk TV presenter wrote, It wasn't luck. Your goalkeeper committed Hari Gary, Emerson Royal tried to break Martinelli's leg, and we absolutely mullered you. And having seen you dance, I really wouldn't be mocking Tony Adams, he added. It comes as Arsenal won 3-1 against Tottenham today. Following Piers comeback, his followers took to the comments, with one writing, Morgan 1, Sugar 0. This evening saw Tony and Katya perform the Charleston to my old man's a dustman by Foster and Allen. Despite Tony's performance being heralded as an improvement by Motsi, Shirley, and Anton, Craig branded it stiff, which Tess branded harsh. In week one, the duo danced the tango to go west by the village people and were scored 15 by the judges which left them at the bottom of the leaderboard. Dot it comes after Tony revealed he initially turned down the chance to join Strictly Come Dancing but after going through heart surgery he made a quick U-turn. Strictly star Tony suffered a heart issue back in 2015 during his time coaching abroad and it pushed him to rethink what he wanted from life. He told Radio Times, I had other things going on, to be honest. I was in China and Azerbaijan for a while, coaching. But when I had my heart scare, he had surgery in Baku in 2015. I thought I'm going to do stuff that I really enjoy. He added, I don't like the jungle one. I can't cook. And dance is good for the mind, good for your health. Despite gaining the unfortunate nickname Donkey during his early days of his career, he is bullish on his chances of making the final of the glitzy BBC show. Tony remarked, there are already better dancers than me, but there were a lot of footballers who were better than me at the start. One by one, I went past them because I wanted it more, 